out and grab some groceries and go to the post office and I came back and they put the trusses up. I missed it! I wanted to video it. So anyway, it's, it's happening, you yeah, guys, it's happening. So exciting. Just a quick little add-on here, the side patio roof trusses have been put on and that'll be my little puppy area out here once we finish putting up the fence on the other side that'll be the, the puppy area and in the background of course they're making a racket a big tree is coming down today it's leaning it's probably going to fall on the shed <laughs> so that's what's been happening in the last few days so here we go we've moved into the new dog room this is my old studio <laughs> everything's gone so the guys are building my new puppy pens that have started. That's the half walls. The puppy pens go right into the new section there as well. There'll be five of them. And this puppy pen here will have a doggy door in it to get outside. So if I need to keep my boys away from my girls, <laughs> you know, sometimes you have to, then they can go in there but still be able to get outside. So. That's the plan. So, yay! Looking forward to seeing the finished product. Just a different little shot for you. You can see there, down in the back there, there's the new studio going up. It's been a bit slow lately, actually, because we've had so much rain and we've had flooding up here in southeast Queensland. The roof was supposed to be on already, but the trucks can't get through so I think it will be maybe next week when we get a roof but uh, the guys have actually pulled off the old garage door today we'll go for a walk <laughs> they pulled that down today and they're just finishing off um, building all the stud walls inside for my new dog room so that's what's been happening today Oh, and they put the fascia on, that uh, timber around the edge of the roof, ready for the garage to go, uh, sorry, ready for the um, roofing sheets to go on. So that's been happening. Once it's all done, we'll get a new driveway. <laughs> look, look at the rain did to our, our driveway. That's the granny flat down there, that's where my youngest daughter lives but it's a bit of a bit of an effort to get down the driveway now the rain rushed down there we're pretty lucky though because we're up high so we don't flood here and there's the two of the guys working working away hard so we'll just come in here a little bit I won't get in their way but you can see there there's the new wall that's going to divide my art studio from my dog room and they're just finishing off putting in those internal walls for my dog boxes so anyway I'll come back to you when, um, when it's time to put the roof on
So the builders have packed up and gone for the day. So I just thought I'd show you a quick little walk through while we're waiting for the roof, because it's gonna be another week. Well, next week anyway. So this is the first dog box. So we're in my dog room at the moment. That's the, gonna be the first dog box. So there'll be a wall there. And then this little area here, this is going to be open and the mums will be able to jump up onto here and uh, walk across and that'll be a dog bed in there. I just put that there to make sure that it was going to fit. And dog door, I'll have to put a little step there. <laughs> um, and then that will be the little outdoor area for whoever's in here or the puppies. And then next to this one, we have these two. Now these two here, will have walls at the front with a little door and then that one will have a wall at the front with a door and then this middle bit that's also a ramp where the mum can jump up walk across and she can either go down this side into her pups which will be around there or the other mum can jump up and jump down onto this side and I'll go around here to where her pups will be there and we'll have power points there so I can plug in my heaters and also night lights so directly opposite these two and I don't call them whelping boxes because my dogs whelp or um, birth on my bed inside um, and then they come out here the next day with mum so but it's more like a puppy playpen, I guess. So directly opposite this one, we spin around, is another one over here. Let's move this cord. When the, um, when the builder was leaving today, he, there was a little knock on the door and um, his battery was flat. I'll just move this. There we go, that's better. Yeah, his battery was flat in his car. So I went up to the shed and got our charger, which was flat because Gemma had used it and not plugged it back in. <laughs> so then we had to run a cable back down and charge it. Anyway, long story short, his car's charged and off he's gone. So there we go, round into that one as well. This is gonna be a nice little niche here. Here and up there. So it'll be like a little shelf there. So that'll be nice. And um, there's a doorway there. So if we look at it from here, there's those two matching, or four actually, there's four there, four matching dog areas. And then we'll go through this doorway and ta-da, we're in the new studio. And that will be a sliding door there. This, I was actually going to put the garage door back up, but we won't be able to seal it. You know, it'll always have drafts and spiders and things. So we're just going to actually put a wall up there. Um, and then when I don't want it as a studio anymore, <laughs> if that ever happens, we can turn it back to a garage. Um, window, window. This whole wall here is going to be full of storage. And this area here, that'll be a cupboard there. Next to it will be a, a sink with a little bar fridge underneath and a bench with coffee and tea making facilities for when I get my classes back up and running and some overhead cupboards. And then just around here will be the powder room. And then that's that little patio I was showing you before for the dogs. So that's, that's what's happening at the moment. But yeah, I thought I'd just get this little video up for you because it's going to be a while before I can do another video once the roof goes up. But I'm very excited about these. My dog area there. And then this is where my couch is going to go. 
just got the trolley in the way at the moment but my couch will go there and there's another little niche there on the wall that's the charger we used for the car that's where my couch will go so I'll be sitting here and then the TV will go on the wall over there to the left of that sliding door and this will all just be open area for the dogs <laughs> there's a couple of them the um, brown door on the left opens up to outside the white door goes into my laundry backyard part of the backyard and then over here this bit here over on the right will be a cupboard over in the left corner will be a little thin like a broom cupboard put dog food and medications and stuff in there and then in the middle below the air conditioner that's going to be a bench and I'm going to put my my clipping area there so I'll clip the dogs there and it'll have some drawers underneath it so there you go a little tour for you hope you've enjoyed that <laughs> I know it's a bit hard to imagine but as we progress I'll show you a little bit more but I thought I'll just get this video up while we wait for the roof so that'll be the next thing because that garage doors off now you see so they could finish the framing all right see you next time